My name is Maria Hasabi. The performance is called Movement Number Two, and it's the early stages of what it will become staged. Stage premieres at the kitchen as part of Crossing the Line Festival in October 2016. And usually when I make work for public spaces, I start thinking about the public space first. And this time it kind of went from thinking about theater and right away taking it to the public space. I like this location here very, very, very much because it's like the old part of the High Line in a way. It has the old and the new. The landscape, I think, is incredible. And because, as you can tell, the work is quite still, I like placing it. I'm interested in placing it in public space just with the, to see the interactions of, not their reactions, but how actually the people live our lives, you know, so much faster and all of that, including myself. And the fact that this is a construction uh, brings it out much more, basically. You know, it's not an imitation of life, it's real construction. For this work, something that is quite different for me making it is that it's the first time that I'm not in the work and I wanted not to be in the work because I wanted to create a very detailed work that and use my eyes to the fullest you know and I knew that if I was going to be in it I would have to the process would have to be so much slower so I would have to go back and forth from using the camera coming back out which I wasn't interested in that, I just wanted to stay looking at all, at all the time and trying to understand what the work was through my eyes, basically. My work is very much about images, yeah? And the way that I work with images is creating them with physicality rather than costumes and lights. So because it's physicality, usually you move fast or you move. And in order to capture this an image, I slow movement down, I hold it still. The body is always three-dimensional, it has so many angles, and it takes a sculptural quality right away when you ask it to be still, when you ask a person to be still.